Hi, this video tutorial I will cover Java Inheritance ECA Relationship. One of the advantages of object oriented programming is code reuse. And there are two ways we can do code reuse. The first way is uh, implementation of uh, inheritance ECA relationship. And the second way is uh, object composition as a relationship. The compiler and Java virtual machine will do lot of work for you when you use inheritance. You can also get at the functionality of inheritance when you use composition. In object oriented programming, the concept of ECA relationship is totally based on inheritance. And uh, inheritance can be two types. The first type is uh, class inheritance and the second type is uh, interface inheritance. And uh, ECA relationship is just like saying A is a B type of thing. For example, apple is a fruit car is a vehicle etc. And inheritance is unidirectional. For example, house is a building but uh, building is not a house. We can easily identify the ECA relationship whenever we see an extend keyword or implements keyword in a class declaration. Then the class is said to have ECA relationship. And uh, this is about uh, Java inheritance ECA relationship introduction and uh, thanks for watching.